Welcome back to my channel, Sister Millie here, aka Hidden Curls, coming to you with another video. As you can see, I have done my first wash and go since my last chop chop. Okay. And this is what I'm looking like. Okay. Now, here's what I use. I did the Dicky. I did the Dicky method. Yes. Along with the Dicky products. Now, prior to BGC, I used to use Dicky and I used to purchase his products. Okay. And this is the size that it used to come in um, when I, you know, start using him over a year ago. And this is the No Suds Cleansing um, Cream. Okay. It's, this was the 16 ounce. They don't, I don't think he has a 16 ounce anymore because when I went on to the website um, to purchase some more because I was getting kind of low. I actually had like used like most of it once I started using the other products like the Innocence products. I had about half a jar and then I used this on my daughter as well. So they don't have these the 16 ounce anymore. At least I didn't see it on there. I just seen the 8 ounce and the 25 ounce. So since I was getting low on that, um, I went ahead and I purchased the 25 ounce this is what the 25 ounce looks like. So this, this should get you through. You know what I mean? This is like a really good size. Okay. It's, it's not cheap, but it's, you know, to me, you know what I mean? Um, it's not a bad price because I don't mind spending money on good quality products. And this is a good quality product because I've used it before. Okay. Um, I also used his quench ultra rich conditioner this is old as well um i only have a little bit of that left in there so what i did was i went ahead and ordered another um one in the 25 ounce because eight ounce is not going to do anything for me because you see this is 16 ounce so eight ounce is not going to do jack okay now the last time i i never tried his kinky kinky curling cream um i think i used his his whip last time Okay, um, the curling whip, I think it was. That's what I used the last time, and that was like over a year ago. So I said, well, since I'm trying Dickie again, I guess I'll try the, the kinky curling cream, okay? And that's what you see here. This is what it's okay. looking like. And I did shampooed and conditioned my hair, shampooed my hair with the No Suds, no such cleansing cream. This, um, I really think that I'm, this is one of the products that I will definitely be using again is the, the no suds cleansing cream. And I'm going to tell you why. One, um, because I have color in my hair and since it's no suds cleansing cream is not a stripping to the hair as regular shampoo, because even though, um, you're not using, I'm not using a clarifying shampoo, shampoos itself can be stripping to hair to your hair if you're using a regular shampoo and you have color or dry um damaged hair and my hair is dry right now and it's i would consider it damaged okay um it's dry and it's damaged point blank period so i'm going to go back to his no suds cleansing cream because <clears throat> i know that this will be um, very good for my hair right now in this current state, okay? So this is what I'm going to be using. What I'm going to do is I'm going to try to use it for like a month or two. I go back to the stylist in December, and I'll see um, what she says about my strands then. But from now until then, I'm going to be using the No Suds Cleansing Cream. I'm going to just stick with the Dickey prop, uh, products, period, for now and um, see what happens. Because like I said, um, when I was using his product before, I didn't have any problems. My hair wasn't as dry. Um, it wasn't breaking. My hair was, was doing well, okay? And this was like my um, second um, purchase. And you see, well, you can't really go by this because my daughter's been using it too. But like I said, I actually stopped using this and started using, first I was using the Matrix, um, because that was with um, Hydrobar. I started using the Matrix and then I went to the Innocence after that. And that's when I was trying to do that whole hydration, um, getting my hair hydrated. And I went, so I'm going back to that. Okay. Back to Dickie. Back to Dickie. 
okay? Point blank period. I don't I don't want to use anything else right now that's stripping to my hair because I have this color in there and I don't want, you know, my hair to get stripped any further. Okay. So, I shampooed and conditioned my hair with I shampooed my hair with the No Suds cleansing cream. I conditioned my hair with the Quench Ultra Rich Conditioner. Quench Ultra Rich Conditioner. Okay. Hair rules. Okay. And then I, you know, I didn't have, I did purchase his leave-in conditioner, but that didn't come yet. And I had never purchased the leave-in conditioner before. So I didn't have that in my arsenal um, to pull out. So I didn't use any other um, leave-in because I want to do his whole line. So I ordered the leave-in conditioner. So I'm waiting for that to come. That'll probably be here in a couple days. So in the meantime, I don't have any leave-in in. Okay. So after I conditioned my hair, then I went in with the Kinky Curling Cream. And after I went in with that, and I did everything in the shower. After I went in with that, I did Dicky Shake. Okay. And voila, this is it is it okay now like i said i did do his his um whole process before and i had good results that's when i actually start seeing some curls if you look back at at past video when i did the dicky shake i was like what and the other thing i want to say is um how you can see your curls the more water you add to your hair prior to throwing a shampoo in is the curlier your hair gets, okay? Because your hair like really likes that water, that moisture, that hydration. So that's why um, I know Dickie says to do it like every, you can wash your hair every day because the more you shampoo it, put that water in, your hair loves it. It loves, loves, loves it, okay? So look, guys, have you ever tried the Dickie products? Have you ever tried Anthony Dickey? I gotta stop saying Dickey. That, that just don't sound right. Um, Anthony Dickey's products. Have you tried Anthony Dickey's products? Okay. Which product did you try? Have you tried his whole line? Like I said, I'm waiting for the leave-in conditioner to come. And his quench conditioner. This is, is the bomb. I love his conditioner. I love his no suds. Um cleansing cream um because i use this on my daughter also as well <clears throat> and um this is the results of the kinky curling cream this is what it's looking like y'all and like i said it's 90 percent dry and i just did the shake i just grabbed the scoop of it went through my hair with it i didn't do no raking and smoothing and all that i just added it to my hair and did it gave it a good shake 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 and this is a result of that. Now, let me turn around so you can see the back. I don't know what that looks like back there, but that is my back. Okay. So, tell me what you think. Huh? Do you like the Dickey products? Have you ever tried the Dickey products? Are you interested in trying the Dickey products? Are you interested in a No Suds uh, shampoo? Okay. Well, No Suds cleansing cream. Because that's what it is. And it does cleanse. Okay. It does cleanse. Trust me. Um, I love, love, love it. I've been loving it. I already had it. Unfortunately, they don't come in this size no more. Um, he just has it. And he said the people were asking for the 25 ounce. So I guess he went from 8 ounce to 25 ounce. So there's no in between that. Um, before it was the 8 ounce and the 16 ounce. But now it's 8 ounce and 25 ounce. Okay. So, what do you think of this wash and go? Huh? It's still a little bit wet, y'all. So, I ain't going to go messing with it. But, um, I like it. Okay? Now, I don't know about doing it every day. I am going to try. I will do it, um, maybe tomorrow. Um, when I take my shower, I'll probably do it. And, but the, with the co-wash, with the uh, conditioner. And, um, mm, I probably do it Wednesday because the day is Sunday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. I know I can do it for three days, but I won't be able to do it Wednesday and Thursday because I'll be out of town um, at my 
meeting that I have to go to every year for the job. So I'll be out of town Wednesday and Thursday. So I will be doing it again Friday. So we'll see how it goes. And tell me what you think. Hmm? I haven't styled it or anything. Like I said, this was just a sure enough wash and wash, shake and go. Okay, that's what this is. Okay, I didn't have to do no raking, no smoothing, no coming, combing through anything. This is this is it. Okay. So guys, tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Until next time, guys. Peace. I'm out. Thank you.